Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. Despite the fear they put in many people, snakes are actually under threat in their own natural environment. Between the pressures caused by invasive species and the gradual destruction of their habitats, it's no wonder that there are a number of snakes that are threatened with extinction. Number 10. Three-Eyed Snake A three-eyed snake found slithering down a road in the northern Australian town of Humpty Doo has sparked amusement in a country already accustomed to unusual wildlife. Rangers dubbed the unusual serpent Monty Python after finding it on a highway in late March. X-rays showed all three of its eyes were functioning, and the extra socket likely developed naturally while the snake was an embryo, said the Northern Territory Parks and Wildlife Commission. Wildlife officers told the Northern Territory News the 40-centimeter, 18-inch carpet python was about three months old and died after about a month in captivity. Until today, I had not ever seen a snake with three eyes, said David Penning, an assistant professor of biology told Live Science. I have seen snakes with two heads and some odd facial deformities, but nothing quite like this. Number 9. Spiny Bush Viper Do you like snakes? Do you like dragons? Well, the spiny bush viper is a rare combination of both. Their bodies are covered in green or brownish keeled scales that give them a bristly appearance, earning them the name of spiny bush viper. Spiny bush vipers are native to Central Africa. They are small reptiles, only growing up to 29 inches for males and 23 inches for females. Spiny bush vipers are nocturnal creatures, spending the daytime basking on top of flowers and small trees about 10 feet off the ground. These snakes feed on small mammals, birds, lizards, and frogs. They hunt mostly in trees, but can hunt for mammalian prey on the ground. Sometimes the color of their scales can offer different tonality, such as blue, brown, or green. For human beings, the bite of the spiny bush viper are deadly if they don't go to a first aid center. In addition, some people have died as a result of internal bleeding caused by its potent venom. Number 8. Short-Nosed Sea Snake Scientists from James Cook University have discovered two critically endangered species of sea snakes, previously thought to be extinct off the coast of Western Australia. It's the first time the snakes have been spotted alive and healthy since disappearing from their only known habitat on Ashmore Reef in the Timor Sea more than 15 years ago. The discovery of the critically endangered short-nosed sea snake was confirmed after a Western Australia Parks and Wildlife officer, Grant Griffin, sent a photo of a pair of snakes taken on Ningaloo Reef to Ms. Donastasi for identification. We were blown away. These potentially extinct snakes were there in plain sight, living on one of Australia's natural icons, Ningaloo Reef, says Ms. Donastasi. What is even more exciting is that they were courting, suggesting that they are members of a breeding population. The researchers also made another unexpected discovery, uncovering a significant population of the rare leaf-scaled snake in the lush seagrass beds of Shark Bay. Number 7. Horned Desert Viper The Horned Desert Viper, or Cerastes cerastes, has two little horns shooting up out of its head. The Horned Desert Viper is a very rare snake that can occasionally be spotted in North Africa. When it buries most of its body in the desert sand, those sharp-looking nubs and the piercing eyes below them are all that you can see. That's either thrilling or terrifying, depending on who you ask, and how close to the snake you happen to be. The snakes are venomous, which isn't great news for you if it's threatened, lashes out, and sinks its teeth in. Its venom is made of 13 different toxins, which can cause hallucinations, mental disorders, organ failure, hemorrhaging, and even death. Number 6. Antiguan Racer The Antiguan Racer is probably the world's rarest snake. This small, harmless lizard-eating snake was once widespread throughout Antigua, but became almost extinct early this century, hunted relentlessly by predators such as mongooses and rats. It is thought that only around 100 individuals now survive on Bird Island, a small island off the coast of Antigua and even this tiny population was damaged by the recent Hurricane George. Since 2014, they have been making a comeback, which is great for the snake, although it's still considered critically endangered. No need to worry, Antiguan Racer is harmless to humans. Number 5. Barbados Thread Snake The world's smallest snake, and perhaps the smallest possible snake, has been discovered on the Caribbean island of Barbados. At about 10 centimeters long, less than 4 inches, 
the diminutive reptile might easily be mistaken for an earthworm and could comfortably curl up on a U.S. quarter, researchers say. A second new species, only slightly larger, was found on the neighboring island of St. Lucia. Due to its small stature, the Barbados thread snake only lays one egg at a time, rather than the large clutches of larger snakes. When hatched, the infant snakes are already two inches long, half their adult length. The Barbados thread snake has a pretty narrow diet because their mouth can barely open. I mean, they're small enough to begin with, but then their mouths don't open like a normal snake. They just barely open up enough to squeeze in a little microscopic insect. Number 4. Spider-Tailed Horned Viper For some, it's the stuff nightmares are made of. A predatory combination of snake and spider. Luckily for those more inclined to lose sleep over such things, it's not as bad as it initially sounds. Until 2001, the viper was known only from a single misidentified specimen collected during a U.S. expedition to Iran in 1968. The weird structure on its tail was so unlike anything documented in other snakes that it was written off as a birth defect or an abnormal growth. Subsequent specimens revealed the same feature and scientists formally described the animal as a new species in 2006. The spider-tailed horned viper has a unique way to capture its prey. It uses its tail to lure its prey closer so it can go in for the kill. It is extremely well camouflaged to look like the rocks in which it inhabits. Number 3. Red Spitting Cobra Why spit venom from six feet away? Stopping, but not killing an enemy. To say, look out, and gain time to escape. Red spitting cobra, when threatened, it rears up and displays a typical cobra hood. It also hisses loudly. If the intruder does not retreat, it may spray jets of venom in the face of the intruder. Venom that gets into the eyes can cause burning pain and blindness. The red spitting cobra is mainly found in East Africa, measuring less than 120 centimeters, 4 feet. The cobra hunts for small mammals and reptiles. The lovely snake can be found in the range of ruddy hues, including deep orange, pale red, pinkish, and light brown. But the fanciest and loveliest specimens are a dramatic blood red. There is a black band on the underside of the neck. Like all snakes, it usually eats frogs and rodents, although it's also a cannibal since the adult snakes eat their young. For this reason, young snakes of the species have a diurnal behavior, so that they cannot be eaten by the adult snakes that have a nocturnal behavior. Number 2. Blue Coral Snake People first heard about coral snakes might naturally think that the snakes live in the sea, hiding, swimming, and lurking in and around some beautiful coral reefs. But the truth isn't so, as coral snakes are totally terrestrial, preferring forested habitat that offers land for burrowing and hiding. Why coral? Because of the stunning, breathtaking colors in most of the species. It inhabits in Southeast Asia, on the islands of Borneo, Sumatra, Java, and on the peninsula of Malacca. It also has the biggest venom gland in the world, extending over a quarter the length of its body. While all venomous snake bites are a serious worry, most take longer than you'd expect to kill a fully grown human. That's because venom typically works by slowing down the body's vital systems until the victim drifts off to death. But the blue coral snake is different. These beautifully colored snakes from Southeast Asia have a venom that's so powerful, it can trigger all of the victim's nerves to fire at once, instantly triggering full body spasms, paralysis, and a quick, horrifying death. These snakes are killer's killers. They specialize in preying on other venomous snakes, including young king cobras, so they can play a hunt the most dangerous game. Number 1. The Malagasy Leaf-Nosed Snake the Malagasy leaf-nosed snake belongs to the species Langaha madagascariensis. They are a species of poisonous snakes, also known as Madagascar leaf-nosed snakes. These snakes have characteristically scaly appendages on the snout. These reptiles get their name from these leaf-like structures. The appendages appear jagged and leaf-like in the females, while the scales are long and tapered in the males. The real function of these structures still remains a mystery. The snakes are arboreal and are enigmatic. Leaf-nosed snakes are the most unique among the snakes of Malagasy. In fact, this snake is so unique that there is no other snake in this genus. The snake finds a place in the book Ophiology, a 1970 book that describes eight genera and 224 species of snakes. The camouflage of these snakes is so brilliant that they are almost impossible to locate. They just look like twigs or a vine. 
This has two advantages. They can easily catch prey using this camouflage and avoid predators at the same time. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoy the video, please let me know by clicking the like button. Do share, write a comment, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.